Hello, my dear students. We are going to study now Unit 3, Lesson 4. It's a grammar lesson. So, I want you all to open your Facebook page number 37. Okay, let's listen. Activity book page number 31. It is about the past simple tense. Our aims today to learn is to learn and break the structure of the past simple tense, affirmative, negative, and the question. How can you form a sentence in the past simple tense, an affirmative and a negative, and how to form a question with the past simple tense? Okay? Okay, but before we start, we're going to... Now, I want you to read and to match the word with the picture, okay? Rafting, number one. Number two, bungee jumping. Number three, rock climbing. Number four, scuba diving. Number five, hang gliding. Number six, snorkeling. Here are the pictures, okay? So who can, I, who can match? Who can answer number one? Okay, I'll give you a chance to have a look. Okay, at the words and the pictures. Okay, then you can say I'm ready to start matching the words with the right or the correct picture. Okay, who can answer number one? Yeah, rafting. So, rafting, picture E. Number one, E, rafting. Number two, bungee jumping. Bungee jumping. To be rock climbing, rock climbing, it's very easy, I think. So, three F. We're going to match number three with F. Scuba diving, scuba diving, scuba diving, A. Number four, A. Hang gliding, hang gliding, number five, D. Snorkeling, and the last one. And the last picture is C. So rafting number one, E, bungee jumping number two, B, rock climbing number three, F, number four, scuba diving, A, number five, hang gliding, D, snorkeling, C. Okay. Now, our lesson today is about the past simple. We use the past simple to express something happened and finished in a certain time in the past. Okay? We have keywords for the past simple. To use the past simple, there is keywords. That means you need to find this word in a sentence to know that it's a past simple tense. Okay? Yesterday, last. Ago, yesterday, last, ago. So you can find these words yesterday, last, ago. These are keywords. Keywords means you need to find these words in a sentence to know it's talking or it happened in the past simple. For example, number one, we played tennis yesterday. If you not hear played, played here is regular verb because we have regular and the regular verb. Regular verbs D or E D. Okay? And here's yesterday. It's a key word for the past symbol. Who can read the sentence? Yes, group number three. Yeah. We played tennis yesterday. Very good. So here D or E D and we have here yesterday. It's a key word for the past symbol. Tense. Number two, group number one. Annie. So his Uncle last Monday. Hanny so or so his uncle last Monday. Last Monday. So here the first sentence is regular D R E D. Here not regular, irregular verb. The past symbol of C is so. And is so his uncle last Monday. They went to Dubai two weeks ago. So here we have three verbs. 
the first verb played second verb so third verb went the first verb regular regular means we add d or ed to the end of the verb okay it's regular verb a regular verb we must keep it memorize it see so go went we're going to separate next so the last sentence or sentence, num sentence number three they went to dubai two weeks ago we have here yesterday we have here last last week last month last monday we have ago yesterday last ago okay so here these are the keywords for the past summer
Okay, here, subject, whether it's singular or plural, it's noun or pronoun, okay, it doesn't matter, I, we, you, they, he, she, it, whether it's a singular noun, whether it's a plural noun, Ali and Omar, okay, in affirmative sentence you can say, I played football yesterday, who can form a sentence, okay, like we, so, a fellow, last Sunday, they enjoyed the game yesterday. So here, we use any of these pronouns or nouns, and this is the verb, this is the verb, it's whether it's a regular verb, like play, played, enjoy, enjoyed, try, try, we delete Y, and we put I, E, D. Whether it's a regular verb, go, went, make, made, see, so, and here are the keywords yesterday, last, ago. Okay. Take care here. I played. We enjoyed. They tried. He went. She made. Ate so. And these are the words. Okay. In negative, we use didn't. Yeah, take care. Didn't. Here, played. Enjoyed. Tried. Went. Made. So, I think it's a mistake because I told you when we form a question or a change the sentence into a negative form we delete d or ed okay whether it's regular verb if it's a regular verb like went made so we move we go back with the verb to the first case let's see so here this is not true take care i didn't play we didn't enjoy you didn't try they didn't go he didn't make she didn't see here this is right for because in question in questions and in negative we use the first case with did or didn't yes no question did and here are the subject whether it's a noun or pronoun keyword the verbs here did we enjoy or play we played or enjoyed it right i think it's a mistake take care let's see the right for yes very good did you enjoy yesterday did you try to play did you go did you make did you see and these are the keywords and this is the this is the right form who can give me a sentence for this Majid yesterday Majid played football yesterday very good Majid played football yesterday Yeah, this picture who can form a sentence. Magic played played what? Football yesterday? Magic didn't play basketball yesterday. Magic didn't play basketball yesterday. Magic here. It's a question here. I wanted to form a question. Did Majid go surfing last week? You can say, yes, he did. Or no, he didn't. Here, it's yes, no question. Did Majid go surfing last week? Yes, he did. No, he didn't. It's a yes, no question. Okay, my friends. Okay, my dear students. Take care. Now... I want you to change the following sentences into negative. Nora went. Take care. I put the verb 
here in red color to take care of it and here the queue wears last summer holiday who can answer Nora didn't go so here didn't go not didn't went Nora didn't go to Kenya last summer holiday another example Nora stayed in a small hotel last summer holiday who can change it into negative yeah yeah are you one of you yes you Nora didn't stay Nora didn't stay in a small hotel last summer holiday sentence number three Omar saw lions at the zoo yesterday Omar didn't see lions at the zoo yesterday so here didn't go didn't stay didn't see take care my dear students my dear friends when you want to form a question when you want to change the sentence into negative we delete d or ed if it's a regular verb okay or put the first next slide now we change this the following sentence into question Nora went to Kenya last summer holiday Nora yeah so we put did did Nora go to Kenya last summer holiday Nora stayed in a small hotel last summer holiday did Nora stay so here did and the verb in infinitive or past form did Nora stay in a small hotel sentence number three Omar saw lines at the zoo yesterday did Omar see take care did and see did Omar see lines at the zoo yesterday number four my uncle traveled to Canada last year yes did your uncle did your uncle travel to Canada last year choose the correct answer my brother his homework yesterday who can answer finish or finished my brother did it his homework yesterday didn't finished or finish take care to negative Omar football yesterday play or played number four did Omar football last weekend play or played now question number five we at three house last Monday last Monday build or built number one my brother finished anything yesterday okay and it's a past simple tense my brother didn't take care it's a negative we will say didn't what didn't finish okay it's a negative Omar football yesterday Omar yesterday so we will choose Omar played yeah now number four question who can answer yes group number three yes very good did Omar play football last weekend we built take care not build it's a regular form of verb we a treehouse last Monday we built treehouse last Monday